Books, always, everywhere? Sounds good to me. Hi, I'm Debbie, and today I'm going to talk about sharing books with babies. Literacy begins with a love of and an interest in books. The best time to start reading to your child is right away. There are oodles of benefits in it. It boosts brain development, builds language skills, and expands vocabulary and cognitive skills such as problem solving. Reading to your baby is also a wonderful opportunity to bond. Interacting with a caring adult is the most important factor in developing early literacy skills, self-regulation, and emotional security. So what kinds of books are good for reading to babies? Books with sturdy pages, board books, vinyl books, and fabric books are great because you don't have to worry about taking them away. Look for simple rhyming text, a few words per page, or no words at all. Babies are drawn to bright, bold illustrations and vibrant photography, especially, um, especially of close-ups of faces. High contrast books are especially appropriate for newborns at birth. Babies cannot see very far away, differentiate colors, or control their eye movements well. The bold patterns and high contrast in this type of book will help stimulate their vision development. Babies learn through their senses. The more senses involved, the more the learning. So um, it's great to have movable pieces, mirrors, sounds, and different textures um, that will encourage interaction and stimulate the senses. We have movable pieces. Um, there's a mirror in here. Um, there's even a speaker in this one. You can find board books um, at our library on the back side of the big yellow school bus in the kids' library. You'll also want to have your own collection. Be sure to sign up for the Dolly Parton Imagination Library. Um, they will send your child um, a free book in the mail every month. Um, and that means for babies, a new board book every month. Go to the kids tab of our um, website to sign up. The number one goal of reading to babies should be for babies to have positive experiences with books so that they will seek out books as they grow. Have fun! If you're reading about driving along a bumpy road, bounce your child on your lap. Um, provide hugs and tickles and sound effects to the books. Reading is more meaningful if your child can um, interact with them in ways that are interesting to them. So let them touch the books and even mouth the books. Babies have a short attention span, so plan to only read a few minutes at a time. Um, that means read short books or even just a few pages at a time. Let your child determine when the session is over. Um, snuggling with a baby um, and a book is wonderful. Also consider reading to your child when they're in a high chair or on the go. It's perfectly fine for them to be moving or holding other objects while you read. Mix sturdy board books in with your baby's other playthings so that they come upon them throughout the day. To ensure daily reading, make it part of your nap time, meal time, bath time, or bedtime routine. As I said before, have fun sharing books with your baby. When you enjoy it, they will too, and it will help set them up for future academic success. Happy reading. See you next time.